Ever felt overwhelmed by endless product pages? In this video, I will guide you how to create one product page for multiple products. This way not only save you time, but also streamline your design process. So let's dive right in and see how it's done. First, let's discover how to create product page. First of all, head over to the PageFly dashboard, navigate to pages, to expedite the process, you can utilize our PageFly product template available here. Next, it's Assign Product, click Page Assignment, and choose the products you want this page to apply to. Now let's design the actual page. Go to the PageFly editor and add a product details element. Set the product source to auto so it will apply for all products that I assigned before. You can freely customize the style of this section. Consider adding a product list element below to upsell and cross sell your product in this product page. Choose the appropriate product collection for this list. Click save and publish your page. Don't forget to rename the page title for clarity. Now, check the live view of the product pages. This is a product page I've already created. Now I will open another product page. You can see the design of this new product page is identical to the design of the previous one. Let's discover the hide default section. On the live page, you might see a default Shopify product section above your PageFly design. To hide it, go back to the PageFly editor, choose page setting sections and click to go to theme editor. In the editor, click the icon on the Shopify section. This hides it from the live view. Save and preview the page again. Now we will get back to PageFly page editor. There is an important note you need to remember in this page. Remember, you can only add product or third-party elements here. These will automatically change for each product. However, regular elements will stay the same across all pages. For example, I will add a section here, then publish the page and check the live page. I will open two product pages at the same time. You can see product information is different, but this section appears on both the pages. Even if you assign a product page to multiple products, PageFly also counts it as one slot. This will help you save slots and make the design of product pages consistent. This is the end of the tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe our channel to get more videos. Thank you for watching.